right, we're here with EJ Vizo. Dude, you gotta be happy. You have to be happy after this weekend. Yeah, so far I'm happy. <laughs> Anyways, I'm not too concerned on mm -hmm. how I'm gonna start the race. I'm more concerned how I'm gonna finish it. Mm -hmm. Anyways, starting in the second row, mm -hmm. it's, a, it's a good beginning. Mm -hmm. I think I'm in a, in a very, very competitive team and they're giving me plenty of the tools I need to do. I need to, in order to, to do a great job in the race. It's an extremely long race, very physically, physical demanding, very mental demanding, and uh, where the difference is going to be who makes less mistakes. The, the driver and the team that does the le least amount of mistakes mm -hmm. is for sure the one that is going to do better in the race. It's such a such a easy opportunity to make mistakes because the risk level is always that high mm -hmm. and everything happens so fast that just pretty much giving that 100% all the time is, is really mm -hmm. I, mean, I want to ask you, um, you know, you're done with qualifying, it's, it's probably a different mindset the way you think, the way you attack the track during qualifying, obviously during the race itself. How hard is it for you to change that mindset? I mean, you've been for the last two weeks thinking fast as I can, one, you know, four laps, that's it. Yeah. Now all of a sudden it's 500 miles. Well, let, let me make a comment on that. Probably one of the things that we focus ourselves as a team since day one mm -hmm. has been the race. Mm -hmm. Probably qualifying, even if it sounds ironic, we didn't prepare ourselves the way mm -hmm. we could have, mm -hmm. because qualifying for us is not that important. Mm -hmm. Said that, I think the result that we got in qualifying is probably uh, more than what we expected, to be honest, because mm -hmm. we didn't even prepare well for that. Mm -hmm. Our focus since day one is being 100% in the race stream, race it up, and I believe we are very well prepared. Um, talk about being prepared for the Indy 500, your setup. What, what is your plan? You know, don't let any secrets out, but you know, how, how are you going to attack the race as opposed to you know, the other, your teammates? Well, for me, this, this, uh, this race uh, is really not about planning anything different to any other race. For me, it's the same race and same, same preparation as any other race, but just being more meticulous and uh, thinking more down to every single detail more than any other one only because the length and the amount of pressure and uh, the fast that the speed that we're going to be reaching all the time we're going to be above 220 miles an hour average mm -hmm. speed and said that uh, you know that the amount of risk factor is going to be always higher mm -hmm. so probably one of those times where where you 100 percent is truly always needed <laughs> All right, Ijo, I know they need you up there to take pictures and this beautiful Miami scenery and all that stuff like that. Good luck this weekend, all right? Thank you.